Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Poigie here, getting ready to take out the French CR714 in Air Arcade. Uh, it's a really good plane for 1.3. It's got four guns on it, which uh, hit pretty good. And it's basically an energy fighter, so you're going to be fast. Um, you can definitely keep your speed up in it. Climbs pretty well, all that. So don't turn fight, just uh, kind of do what we do in the video here. You should do good. Let's take it out and see what we can do. All right, the map is coursing. We've got our stealth ammo, 800 meter targeting distance, minimum fuel load. Looking good to go. Going to turn our WEP on, climb at 30 degrees. And it's used on the other team. So they do have a 1.0 there, which means it's a 1.0, 2.0 match, which means it's uh, just mostly tiered up. Nice difference from when we were flying the 1.0s. Climbing like this is going to give us two advantages. One, we should have an energy advantage over any of our opponents who don't climb. And two, it makes it so our teammates, if you look at the radar, are going to get to them first. So it's unlikely we'll be the first ones targeted. I was thinking about the F2A, but let's just take what we can get down here. Let's try and stay out of his way for the moment. Got 50 cows that'll chew us up good. Good hits there. The uh, fight's happening at a higher altitude than I'd expect for a 1020 match. We'll swordfish over there and catch him when we're done over here. He's down. Let's see if we can help our buddy out with the fury. Look like that worked. I 15. Just tried to do it without hitting any of our teammates. We really did that. Alright, swordfish is pretty far away. We're just going to reload and uh, turn our speed into some potential energy with the climb. Key 10 should get him. Alright, vertical turn. Vertical turns are basically called Immelmans, if you didn't know. Unless you do a full loop. Uh, Stuka down below us. A couple guys to the right I just saw on the radar. We should be going after them next. Let's take this BF2C since he's on the way there. Just flying right past planes. No shits to give. The hits in them. Let's check on the TVD. TVD's down. We're on a reload. They're not really coming over to our side, which is where we like to fight. Much rather fight on our side of the battlefield, but sometimes just gotta go chase them down. Disadvantage to that is if you get in a fair fight, um, they're likely to get support from their teammates before we do. Alright, helped him find something better to do or a new plane. TBD. He has a back gunner we got to be careful of. The fire rate on these things sounds really good. Something just shot at us. Try to avoid. Avoiding didn't work too good, so let's bring it back towards our friends. And try to hang them up in the air. While we're doing it, let's shoot that guy down so our friends try and help us. Instead of going after him. Almost made our escape. A little furry behind us. We can outrun him. Just need him to miss a little bit. So now that we're far enough away and he turned, we can go ahead and head back in. Looks like our buddy's got him pretty well done. We'll help finish him off. Act two, he's got 20 mils. Need to be careful of those. 
He's not very maneuverable, so. I want to reload there, I didn't realize. Heard that F3F go, there he is. So we ended up with nine air kills, few assists. We got survivor, so most kills without dying, and uh, first place on the team. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll catch you on next one. America! Fuck yeah! To save this fucking day, yeah! Beautiful.